just been experimenting with Cursor's new background agents and they're pretty good but you need to use them in a very specific way. The way you access them is here, you go to background. Cursor will then spin up a little agent which sits on a cloud server and it can do your bidding. So I got really excited because I thought I'd be able to give it a long form task and it would just get on with it by itself. Specifically I've got a website that I'm putting together right now which has about 80 playbooks on it. Each of them is 5,000 words. There's a lot of content and I want a AI to basically go through it all and write SEO, search engine optimized titles and descriptions for all of them. And Cursor is actually really good at this, uh, doing it through Gemini. But what I was finding was that I was babysitting and having to say, okay, do the next one, do the next one, do the next one. So while it was still faster than doing it myself, it was taking a long time. So I thought with this background agent, I would be able to just say, okay, go and look at all of these 80 different playbooks and write out titles, write out descriptions, work out the SEO for me. And it doesn't really work like that. Instead, what it does is it runs the tasks like it would normally. Uh, it just does it in the background. But then it just completes the task and it waits for the next steps. It was waiting for me to say, okay, do the next part. It's not fully autonomous, which is probably for the best which means that it's good with small tasks that you set it and it goes off, it spends five minutes doing it and the task is then done. It is not for leaving it overnight off doing its own thing. Why this is still really cool though is you can have multiple agents all doing little tasks for you. So let's say you have 10 things on your list that you want to get fixed. You can set up a background agent for each and every one of these and they'll all go off and do this in parallel. They'll all be working on their own task. Each one might only take five to 10 minutes, but you have 10 tasks being done at the same time. You can then check in. They'll give you a progress report, see if they've done a good job, um, give further instructions if they need them, or commit the changes to your main project. So it's not 100% what I was looking for, and I get it, that's fine, um, that's a big ask. But used in the correct way, uh, which I was not doing, this is really useful because you can now be working on 10 different things at the same time, which is exciting.